Hello everybody, welcome back to the stream, and we are back with Asphalt 9 again, and finally, I can say it, I finally own Jessica in this game after like, what, 11 months of delay? I think I've done like, 9 streams total for this, uh, for this car, so. Yeah, across both Tri Syndicate and its Grand Prix and like, anything else it was used in, so. We finally own it. Four stars. You guys already knew that, because I revealed that the Grand Prix results, but we have the key. No nonsense. Unfortunately, they didn't release packs, so I couldn't go for five stars afterwards, but... Um... Yeah, we finally have it, so... Anyway, enter our normal stuff. We got, a uh, Free pack. I see a Gensi for credits there, so we are going to jump on that. And, um... Yeah, we got some... Lack of races today. And also we have an overlap in the special event with our NPCs, and so I have to decide which is more priority. Um, so, general gist of things. All we have left now is the CN event right now. You like the signing shirt? So, I don't know, quick plug, but check this out. New shirt. Got this, uh, last weekend. Really liking it. So, nice that you spotted that. So easily. The text says Sonic the Hedgehog faster than you, so... I thought it was pretty cute. Anyway. Reset the HDMI. Ugh. I think I know the source of the issue. It's when I turn on the Elgato before I plug in the HDMI. So, thanks for spotting that. You all know the drill at this point. So, thanks for spotting that. First, you the key for game off. No, I had to grind that myself um, in the Grand Prix. I didn't get gifted or anything like that, or tokens. I haven't been gifted by Gameloft for a project since the Porsche 918 review almost two years ago. And yeah. And yeah, I have 86 cars. I'm only missing the Gallardo, the Taken, or Taycan, however you pronounce that, um, the Tech Rolls, the Avija, and obviously the unreleased cars. Today we'll probably own the CN though. But, um, yeah, hopefully the game audio should be fixed now. But yeah, we have the CN event. Um, we get some free tries with the SC18, with what looks like unlimited fuel, which is really nice. Yeah, where's the Dodge Dart SC? And then we get a Terza race, which has limited fuel. But the Terza is also in the NP season today. So I think what we're going to do is we'll do one race from this. Um, just so we can get some conditions and get some CN blueprints to help us out, because we will unlock this today, I think. Big slacker and rip. To be fair, our, I'm in this club in a LUT. I'm the third club, which doesn't make much rip. So, yeah. Also, this is only a 30 second race, so I might have to refill just so I can get some more MP races because this is going to be really short. So, we have to do five stunts and beat uh, 30.5 seconds. So, yeah, so that's for you. So, we're going to start with the Terzo, I guess. You don't like the orange, Jesco? I like it. So five stunts. That includes knockdowns, though. So if we get five knockdowns, that would be better. It looks like the cars are going fast. The rubber banding with the AI is really weird. Alright, we'll just spin it. That should be five. Yeah, you can't even win. But look how quick that was. And yeah. The blueprints only occur once, but you have to grind ten times for the other stuff, for the other conditions. So that's all we'll do from the special event. We'll get some blueprints. We need all the help we can get because we're going to try to unlock this thing today. And we have still, what, what is that, 37 blueprints to go? I think I do get a blueprint from 200, so we'll have to watch out for that. We can also try with the CN because um, that has unlimited fuel. But yeah, we'll spend the rest in uh, multiplayer. I think we'll do we'll some ads just to, we'll watch some ads today just to get some more races in. Because I did a couple races with the Terzo, and I only got one or two opponent races yesterday, so you guys gotta step it up. 
Look at that. Silver League is the top 100, so. The PS5. I will talk a lot about the PS5. I have a lot to say about it, but y'all know the stream. It's two hours. We'll have plenty of time to cover that. Um, so, yeah. Asphalt 8, yeah, has been slaughtered, but you guys know that already. And look at that, one, one opponent race, see? You know, I would, I'd be alright with racing if there was more, like, you know, full lobby, but I'm kind of surprised, because I would think a lot of people have this car. The special event wasn't that difficult, and I have this car three stars. So, I don't know. I'm going to take the safe route. Because this car is kind of weird on how it drives in multiplayer. I've seen that a lot of people don't know the optimal strategy for this car, which is momentum preservation. I don't know how it drives at six stars, though. But so far, I've won... All the races are driven pretty easily, just because of how this thing drives. Uh, next week we should have the Grand Prix for the SC18, so hopefully we'll have more races to do in that sense, but that means more token dumping for um, probably another update then. We'll be close to done with the Lambo season. So I wonder what's going to be on the table. The McLaren F1 obviously is a subject, a talking point, but what else could they release? what makes them give the Jesco and Lamborghini C and also kind of easily. You know, if you have the tokens, this is a pretty straightforward event, so there's got to be something big on the table. Anyway, like I mentioned earlier, easy race. Like, I think the guy had a higher car rank than me, and I don't even see him on my map. So <laughs> this is just as entertaining as Rush MP, honestly. And yeah, Asphalt 8 is getting a new track, which I can't believe they're getting a new track, but Asphalt 9 is not. We haven't had a new track since Osaka, like, six months ago. So, yeah. Alright, last race with the Terzo here. Maybe I'll type go to get some more people in here. We'll do the Centenario Rocket. We got plenty of, uh, time killers to do. Yes, Grand Turismo 7 has been announced. I am so excited for that, but obviously I'll talk about that a little bit later. Yeah, apparently the Dodge Tomahawk bike got leaked in Asphalt 8, which is, um, weird. All I'm gonna say. Very weird. Yikes for all you who missed out on the Jesco key. I mean, at least they're not afraid of re-releasing it, but I don't know what they're going to do next after this. They might they might continue doing Grand Prix for re-releasing special event cars. Another one-person race. See, these are all 1v1s. So we are going to spend tokens today for the CN, I think. Um, just because the pack is 750 and... I do only plan on getting it to one star. Maybe two stars for free from the event if there's enough uh, luck in there, but we'll see. But as you guys saw, I was able to recover the 30,000 tokens. They've been pretty generous with how much they give, and plus, you get a thousand tokens for doing the Lamborghini Experience race with the with the CN. So let's see. Oh, there's no contact at all in this season, so the racing is boring as well. That's great. Acceleration is still weird in some places. Did you see a Feek's Aviks video of the Jesco on this track? It's like unreal. And if that was on Grand Prix, I'd be dead. Because <laughs> this track is awful. Especially this part on these fast cars. Where you get like glitchy ramps. So. You know, you don't know what's the uh, the best thing to do when you're on a perfect run if you risk it. Especially when you're doing the official attempts. 
But thankfully that's over. And look, gained another 6 rating. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to spend uh, some ads. Just so that we can do some more racing because, wow, that, that burned out pretty quick. So I'm going to turn off the game audio and we're going to roast some ads, alright? 127 people, this is what we do all day. So, ooh, it's a click ad, so... This goes fast. <laughs> Did you see that cut? <laughs> it went from 6 hours to 2 hours 26. What was that? Did you see that? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Game off can't even math right. That's hilarious. Can I, Does that mean this refills 100% after this? I, I'm shocked. I just mentioned it a week like 30 seconds ago. So, anyway, after a long <laughs> wordplay ad, what is this going to drop to? Okay, see, now it's actually doing the math, but <laughs> that, that was really funny. And now we gotta watch the same ad over and over. So this is the real torture. That was more than 50% cut. Stonks, mega stonks, I'll say that. <laughs> I didn't do anything except click the ad. <laughs> so, I mean... I would have watched more ads, but there you go. Also, the game's not soft locking, so I think I'll drop this to like a one hour wait time. Maybe less, but mega stonks. See, so yeah, I guess I'll talk about the PS5 right now since we're in some downtime. So, on Thursday, they finally revealed the PS5 after the delay um, in a live stream. And, uh, yeah. What a console to start. So, this week should have been E3 as well, so it's nice that we got to see some new stuff, and um, they opened with like a new Spider-Man game, which I think is going to be really nice. I love the first one. But then they went right back and revealed a new Gran Turismo. as well. When they had Kaz on the screen for the interview, I screamed, because I was like... I That was, that was true. I thought it was rumor, you know? I've become so numb to like rumors. That when it actually happens, I was really surprised. But yes, there's a new Gran Turismo on the way, actually called Gran Turismo 7. And then they flash the, uh, the main menu in simulation mode, and it's like a homage to GT4. I, I almost, like, came, because, like, that was so awesome. So now we are under an hour. I'm going to do one more ad, and then we have to figure out what to burn uh, fuel on. But yeah, Trial Mountain is back as well, which is awesome, and then according to some pictures on Twitter, Grand Valley also might be back, which I wouldn't be surprised. That track is a staple, so I wouldn't expect them to only have one track. Alright, 46 minutes, let's go. So we'll be back for the Terzo, hopefully we can get some more people populated in that. Um, so yeah. We do have the SC18 that's on the field, but... You know, it's kind of boring. I think the Chet Scenario right is probably better because I could use some more effort parts from that. And let's turn back on game audio before I forget. But yeah, Grand Turismo 7 looks so hype. It looks like it's GT Sport with like an actual campaign mode, which is fine with me, honestly. I think GT Sport's driving is awesome. And then the car list, there's like a Porsche Career GT, Lamborghini Murcielago, Porsche 911 GT1, the same one from Asphalt 9. Porsche 917K, a lot of new Porsches, and um, a bunch of the race cars from GT Sport Return, so it'll be interesting to see how that fully develops. I hope they have more cars than GT6, but also high quality. I don't know if that's too much to ask for. And look at that, 5% need for the chance scenario, so we don't have to push as hard, but let's go give it a shot. I haven't done a single race with this, so I wonder if I should spend some epic import parts somewhere. I have, I have three. I haven't done Elite S yet. We will drive the Jesco today, but I'm not sure if I want to do that in a club race or in the events because I am terrible at the event right now. And I don't want to burn uh, three fuels there. To the reaction to Grand Turismo 7. I couldn't do it live um, because I was uh, not in a place to do that. But anyway, how much do I think the PS5 will cost? So I didn't talk about the console itself. Um, along with all the other games they announced, um, the PS5 announced 
you know, I don't, I don't know what to do. Do you think acceleration or handling would be better if dumping board parts on? It's one of these two. I think Nitro is fine. But I think the PS5 with its alien design, I want to get the disk drive version. Handling, we'll go with that. That's the first one I saw. We'll put at least one import part there. Um, I'm gonna say it's gonna cost 600 bucks. That sounds, that sounds right. So you guys think handling acceleration? What do you think, um, Afik or anyone else watching? Use Jesco in the land of snow. Excel. Oh, now everyone's spamming acceleration. So we'll use the other two on acceleration. The chat scenario does need a handling. So ideally we want both of these to be maxed up. I think this is probably fine. Anyway, let's go. Three fuels. Let's see. This is my first attempt. Very first attempt. But yeah, maybe the discless version would be like 500, 550, but I'm not sure. But then storage is going to be a huge problem. Oh, I was trying to get a knockdown there. You see, like this section, for instance. I feel like AI is going to ruin it half the time. I got kind of lucky there. So yeah, don't expect this one to be perfect, but... Let's see what we can do. Hopefully get 5%. I think a lot of people have this car, so it won't be too difficult. Aw, oh, we almost had a great turn in there. But we still have our shockwave, so... Aw, oh, man. We hooked the other direction. Okay. Well, at least we can still go this way. I'm not gonna go for the drop, even though it's probably faster. Oh wait, wait, this is the track you have to do the drop. Oh man, handling. All right, we'll do another attempt. We'll see where this puts us. Well, this, this is terrible, okay. And then I lost my speed there. I'm forgetting all the tracks in Asphalt 9. They're so blending in. It's weird, because I knew every track of Asphalt 8 inside out. I knew which track I was driving on, but this one I don't even recognize it half the time. I would say it's because of my old age, but I'm 20, so... <laughs> and... Yeah. Bruh, Feek, you're trying to steal my audience? I saw, um... I think it was Moonwalker posted a run. I didn't watch that, though. <laughs> Hey look, the uh, season pass that nobody cares about. And yeah, that's that's 10% though, so we have to be in like the top 500, so let's try that again. Obviously I want to see if I get like top 50, but... Yeah. People complain all the time about the car hunts, but I don't care about the car hunts, I care about the riots. I'd rather not dump all my time into a, one car that's unlocked in career. And people think like, oh, the, uh, the Avija or the Genti is going to be a car hunt. No, it isn't. I'd be very surprised if they ever release the Genti in a car hunt. That'd probably be more like a burst of speed or something like that. Oh, yes. Better start. Aw, oh, just missed the perfect run. It was gonna come in. Let's go wide there for a second, because I forgot about the... It's not perfect turn. So I'm gonna turn in early. Very early. And it's still not good enough. I 
feel like you can get airtime there, which Afik probably did. In the top one runs. I think that's the right thing to do. I'm gonna avoid the ramp. And what's that gonna put us at? 137.5. That's in 130 bucks. That'll be for 5%, but I don't know if I want to burn another fuel on that and instead try something else. It looks like 137, so low 137 is better. Why can't I do the leaderboard with my thing? I can't drop down to click on the leaderboard. There we go. <coughs> Excuse me. Anyway, let's see. 134 is I'm expecting. Ooh, 133 even. Yeah, electric sheep, not surprised. Where is a fee cat? Did he go for a run? Also a lot of LU in the top 10. Where's a fee cat? Or is it a failed attempt? I don't know. That should be okay for top 5%. We might go for more, but I'm not 100% sure. You have not played yet. Yeah, I'm wearing a Sonic t-shirt, so that that's me. That's totally me. So now I'm not sure what to do. I think this is alright for 1% probably. I could push more and then this one. So this is my awful time with the Jesco. Obviously I had a big mistake in my lap. I just think it's funny how many other Jescos are there. Yeah, I just can't. There we go. I see you don't know. Hello, I like money. Two. Thank you very much. Uzumak Games one percent. I don't know if I pronounced that right, but thank you very much for the two dollars. I appreciate it. We'll unlock the CN. I think so. Let's do that. We're all here, so let's first uh, collect any tokens we have outstanding. We have thirty thousand five hundred. We're gonna dip below that once again because I hate myself. We did not buy packs yet, we're going to. Let's get some more credits. But yeah. Driver fish. Whoa. How is life Lucas face with monocle face with monocle? Jason Young, welcome back, man. Life is weird these days, but... You know, what can you say? In asphalt, I think things are going pretty all right. And then working a full-time job during the week, which is pretty nice. It's nice to have that. I forgot to turn on my dashboard so I can actually read some more donations. Not through text-to-speech. Watch you news Jessica run. I didn't yet. All right, so let's not delay anymore. We're almost 25 minutes in the stream. Here's the pack. 750 tokens for um, this, and I think, yeah, it also includes the other cards. So, like, there's the Gensi and the Senna and stuff. So, I think I said I needed 37 blueprints, which is still quite a lot. So, hopefully, we can get some luck here. How long do you think they'll support Asphalt for? I have no idea. But, send a prayer for our tokens and, uh,. I'm going to spam that token emoji. Mem members, if you're watching, flare up. Flare up with the tokens. The Seraphim R1 link is outdated. They launched on Amazon, I know that. But I never got like instruction on what to do once they went public. But yeah, let's flare up. 
Let's go. So, here we go. First pack. Game before double jackpot. I don't know. Oh god, this is not looking good so far. Yikes. Big yikes. Oof. Okay, big hoof. Alright, not what I wanted. And we still need a lot. So, here we go. If I get, like, another three, it's like... Oh my god, what is the drop rate on this car? There we go. There's one. Are we getting another uh, round of sixes? Like the Jesco? Oh, there we go. <gasps> oh, shit! <laughs> what did I say? <laughs> Bro, bro. It's like, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> I was just saying, like, oh my god, we're gonna quit if we don't get, you know, like if we get another three. But then, there we go. <laughs> That's my first jackpot in a while since I think the Aston Martin GT12. So that's how we do it. So hopefully, we can get another uh, stint of good luck. I still need like 15 blueprints though to get it, so we could get really unlucky coming here. It's sad that when you have a jackpot, that only moves you a little bit closer. And then look, there's gonna be another three. <laughs> I'm not even getting supplementary blueprints. Alright, so we got 10 to go. Actually, if I can grind enough of the um, SC18, we might be able to actually unlock it with just three more drops. But let's see where we go from here. I'm not gonna look because that spoils it. Let's go. Try not to spoil it in the chat. Oh my god, there's a CN drop. I need more though. Gross. Okay, so this last one will be it, thankfully. So one more. Hopefully. I mean, if not, we'll just grind to the one blueprint from the extra rewards. Hey, like a 570S blueprint, but just one. And there it is. That's yeah, Sheeran Blueprint. Also, we unlocked it. What? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> what, what? Okay. So, we got four drops there. Pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. So, there it is. CN is ours. And we didn't spend that many tokens, honestly, on it. So, I'm happy with that. So, there we go. CN is ours. I don't know how we can drive it today. And also, I don't know how many, um... How many blueprints we have. So you need 25 for 2 stars, so I don't think it's probably worth not worth it to uh, go for that. We do get some epic import part packs, but are there import parts? There are regular ones in here, so that's probably what you're going to get. They do throw in a CN part here. And then you only get 500 tokens for 2 stars, so it's probably not worth it. I know if you have 6 stars, it's like 3,000 tokens, but that's only one shot. They should give you more money back. And also, I have to actually get to these conditions, which is something I noticed is that for here's my progress in the SC18. Obviously, Grand Prix is going to give us some more um, shots at this, but we got that. And then the Terzo, we got... Some of that. Veneno. I only have uh, one star. It's only 21 conditions there. I don't even have the Gallardo. And I don't think I'll release packs or anything. That's a pay to win car. And then you need to get 250 to get to here. So I don't know how I feel about that. And yeah. I think maybe we should uh, get our money back from the 1,000 tokens. From the uh, Lamborghini experience. Because I've already done all the other races. Um. But you get a thousand with the C in, which is pretty nice. Need 69 blueprints to 6 star. Nice. I have not spent a single real dollar on this game. Um, I mentioned earlier, but I don't have the tech rolls. I don't have the Avija. I don't have the two pay to win cars, so the Taycan and the uh, Gallardo.
finish the Lambo career season? Good idea. Let's do that first, so. Before we drop back into regular MP, let's do that. So, putting Rise. And here's our CN. I don't think I could do any custom colors at one star, but. Yeah. Yeah, so we got a jackpot. I'm still kind of surprised at that, you know? I'm not as hyped as I was like in like the Corvette or something because I'm only getting this for one stars, but at least we didn't have to spend as much. So we're better prepped for the S18 and the next update, which hopefully has some good stuff. I didn't see if I have any secondary goals, but I think I just have to win the race. So how does this car drive at one star? I don't think I've ever actually driven this at one star. They've only given us a trial at six stars, but... It looks like it actually performs kind of similarly to its uh, upgraded variant. The speed is definitely close, but handling accelerators are definitely lacking. But this is not the king at all. A fake run. Oh, he's gonna steal all my viewers. I still don't like the new Nitro, where you have to use perfect Nitro. It just like makes it very inefficient. The driving experience is not as good. Your 102, Jessica. See, I know how to do... So... We complete the season. I know how to do like a 102 with the Shiran, but with the Jesco, I have no idea what you have to change about it. So we're still waiting on the Kenti before we can finish career. We still need that car. I swear it like never gets re-released. They just don't want people to have that car. So let's see. I don't know what I should do. If I should do one attempt at the Jesco. Oh wait, are you talking about the uh, Osaka run with the Jesco? I did see that, and I think I left a comment on there too. But um, yeah, and then there's the uh, the S Class Elite, which I didn't see the route. And to be fair, I don't know if it's the same with the uh, Shiran's route. And um, yeah. what was the first video game I ever played? It was Spire of the Dragon on the PS One. That's one of my all-time favorite games. You think we should try it with the Jesco? I have no idea. Let's see. She's just no route watch, just try to see what we can do with the Jesco. I know probably getting a force barrel at the start is probably better. There's another Osaka run. Yeah, I don't know. Let's try one. We got the Jesco though, so let's uh, let's mess around with it. Also, we have one import part, which I believe should go on acceleration, but I haven't decided where to spend that yet. I wish there were more though. The Jesco route is kind of different. Maybe we should check that out first. So, um, free advertising, I guess, for a feek. So, let's see. I could find Oh, so you did another nine what's tour. So I'm gonna mute just in case. And I don't know, we're gonna check out your run Afik. Enjoy the free advertisement. So let's see. So you're drifting early to get shockwave. And then you up to a force barrel. Makes sense. Plugging that perfect nitro. And keep the spinning going. Oh, that was lucky. No nitro until you get to the exit. Oh, that was a... That's a hard barrel, but you have six stars, and it looks like you got a good landing, so. Let's 
so weird with this card that you have to like keep pushing the drifts like that. How floaty drifts back. It's amazing how a new technique got invented just like that. Alright, so there's your free advertisement. So, let's go. Chesco. Let's try this. I'm going to absolutely fail this, but we'll do one run because I want to save a club race for this car. Since, you know, it's the Jesco, you only get three races. The car is stupid fast. So let's see. My best time was a 105, which was awful. So that's the first time I'm seeing that new route. All right, not bad. Oh, I hooked, I hooked the side of the ramp. Oh, don't hit the truck. There we go. Oh, I lost all my speed turning a little too hard there. Okay, so this is not good, but let's continue. Did I just see an AI behind me? That's funny. So that's a 1027. That's much better, but not perfect. But that's about what I would get with the Shi run on a okay run. Or a good run. Not a great run, but a okay run. And that's in top 26, so... Not bad for my first shot at that. But not 1% either, so we'll push for that, but off stream, so... But at least I got an okay run in. My start was good, so... There's that. Not bad. Obviously I'm not a fake though, so... I forgot to like the video. Oh man. Alright, I'll like it later. We're running the stream. And yeah, that 360 to barrel transition, I don't know how to do that. I don't want to do rush season, but like that's all we got going right now, so. Um, I could do another run with the Centenario, or I can make my money back on the CN. Let's make our money back on the CN. I do know who Eris is. We, ha we have a history. But I don't think I need to say much. Wasn't a fast double force barrel. I've had better starts. I think squeezing the Sheeran for a knockdown might be helpful, rather than drifting very early. But I'm not sure. Anyway, all we have to do is win this race, then we'll make our money, some money back from the. Uh, you get like 1,300 tokens from just unlocking the scene, which is pretty nice. That's like two packs almost. I do think they were quite generous with the tokens they gave on this event, which is nice. But it also scares me because there might be something big coming in the next update. Like, very big. So this car doesn't do floaty drift very well. Most of them don't. It's really the S-Class cars, the top ones, that have a high top speed. Like the Tryon, Regera, and Jesco, obviously. I think the Sheeran can do it too. So there we go. Things you like to see. It... Oh man, that's nice. That's nice. So all we have left is the uh, Gallardo and SC18 doing that, and they pay out pretty well. 
but okay, I don't know how I can unlock that for free unless they release a pack, but I don't know. Also, we only have one feel, so. Hey, I beat a Feek in MP before like three times in my life. <laughs> I have beaten a Feek in a race. I, like, uh. I, for every race I win against a Feek, he wins against me 600 times. <laughs> so. But I have beaten him before in a race. Yeah, Venom F5 or SSH Sweats are very likely candidates for if they're going to release a top S-Class car, so... Can I even use C-Class in Rush? I can. Oh wait, that's right, because I'm in Silver League, duh! We need some- oh wait, we need more fuel, we need like two fuel for um, the SC-18. I believe. Yeah, and I, I need to wait two minutes, so we gotta do one race with something and then we'll do um, SC-18. Which we have unlimited fuel for, which is pretty nice. I don't know. Let's drive something. Uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, Venser. Let's go. Unless they throw a curveball and like spike us with a car like the Camaro SS or something like that, go full asphalt eight on us. But definitely three hundred mile per hour car. Something. Gamer's house. Nice name. <laughs> How am I doing? So, I'm doing alright. Um, situation, I already, I addressed some stuff last week. Um, not much has changed, honestly. If anything, just more depressing stuff. But I don't know. When you're following the news, it's like just, everything becomes numb to you. But, you know, they're very... I think I've said enough about stuff, but you guys all know we're all welcome here in this community and we're just here to have a good time. It's sad that we have to, um, well not we have to, it's sad that there are still problems that exist, at least in my country. But, um, I'm here to play video games. But, I don't know, I don't want to... I don't want to like rub off the wrong way, but you guys already know, for the most part, what we're about here. Anyway, I mean, I'm doing okay personally, but um, just vibe out here. We're here to play some Asphalt 9. Anyway. That race was pretty simple. We're at 1900. I forget what you need to get to gold. I think it's like 2200. So we might grind to that today. Yeah, 2200 is what we need. So we can actually get that today and start driving some B class cars. But let's see. Spencer with the motor of the Corvette. It is a muscle car technically. So I don't know. If that was enough time to get the second fuel, it is. So here's the SC18. Hey, well you can you can rewind the stream. That's on, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, the events are in Asphalt 8 is forgettable. So here's the SC18. I think I can only upgrade it to one star, but I haven't done anything regarding that. But you get unlimited races with this, which is nice. They should allow this on all the other they should allow this on practices and stuff. Favorite Crash game, like OG Crash Bandicoot game? Um, I thought the Insane Trilogy was pretty awesome, but that's a re-release, so I don't know if you count that. Um, CTR, the original, was one of my favorites, I think the... Um, Crash 3 was pretty awesome, although I've never played the PS1 version on hardware. Um, I liked Crash Twin Sanity, Nitro Kart. Like those couple PS2 games. First one is very frustrating, but nostalgic. Also, small quick about this car. The timing for Perfect Nitro seems off. <sighs> wow. At least I don't have to win the race. Again, though, the AI doing their thing. Do you think we're getting a bit easy on the virus? I do feel that way, because I noticed in a lot of states that have reopened, 
there are spikes going up and I hung out with some friends a couple days ago and we had started to walk to a park to play some basketball and there were like 60 people there. Some people with like their shirt off to that full. No one wearing masks so it's like okay that's a coronavirus breeding ground. Let's not do that. See I do think things are going a bit out of control but what can I do? So, fun to drive at stock for the S18? Uh, I don't know. I feel like this, it's just going to be another forgettable A-Class car. And I think the Huayra will still be superior. Like, every new A-Class car that gets released has a fatal flaw about it. The Huayra BC is just perfect. Like, car's better acceleration, it will lack in nitro or handling. If it has good top speed, it will lack in acceleration or something like that. Or nitro. Oh yeah? Why don't you come over Mohammed? Right now. I already... That's funny. Yeah. You know my address? That's nice. So why don't you come on the stream right now? Be my guest. Yeah. Be my guest right now. We're about to win with the Alfieri. Yeah, I just feel like since the summer started, people just like, I don't know, don't care about the virus anymore. And with civil unrest stuff there, people believe there are more important issues than the virus, but, you know, the virus didn't just go away. It's gonna come back and, you know, school season starts in like two months. So, things are just going to magically disappear. We need progress still. And if we have to go back to full quarantine again, people are just going to get more depressed. Yeah, apparently the Aperta is better than the BC, but since, you know, the Aperta is so rare to unlock and actually acquire blueprints for, no one can, like, really grasp it. I know LH, um... I think he maxed both the Genti and the Aperta, which is obscene. Yeah, I wonder how Lando Norris feels when everyone's just spamming milk in his chat and he's like, guys, I'm trying to play a video game here. Mario Odyssey, that was a fun game. That was a fun game. I wish the rumors about them re-releasing the um, the classic 3D Marios were true. They have been fully confirmed. There is a new Paper Mario coming, but I want to play Mario 64. Or maybe if they release the N64 Virtual Console on the Switch, that'd be also nice. It's not to know. Also, we just won in the Elf Fury. Yeah, we have a lot of memes. Good day for memes. It's always a good day for memes, though. Favorite Mario game? Not including Mario Kart, Wii, or Mario Odyssey, but those are my two favorite ones. Um, I kind of grew up with Mario World, but I played it on the Game Boy Advance. I do have, um, I do have the Super NES version, though. I have a cartridge of it, and an SNES that doesn't work, but I have played Mario World, like, on the virtual console and stuff, and that was a pretty fun game. Um, see, I don't know, I didn't grow up with Mario, as I'm wearing a Sonic the Hedgehog t-shirt. Why does Firam not show up anytime here? I don't know. He lives his life. Is 
The GR1. I like this car. It doesn't get enough appreciation. I just got relegated to a trade coin car. I still haven't seen Ford vs. Ferrari. You would think I would, being the biggest Ferrari fanboy, but you see, I know the ending. <laughs> so, I don't want to relive PTSD, no. My parents weren't even alive when that happened. If I was the owner of Asphalt 9, what would I do? Um, quit my job. Because <laughs> I do not want to manage this mess of a project. We're also pretty close to um, four-starring the Ortega. You want the voting system in MP, but if it was Asphalt Eight's voting system, it would be it would be broken because Asphalt Eight had a messed up system. Will I be playing The Last of Us Two? Absolutely. I weirdly enough, I had played the first one back when it came out in 2013, but I never finished it. In yeah! Branson. Yeah! Hello there. What I miss? You missed us unlocking the CN. Which was a fun time, and then also we did some we did some racing events, but mostly we're back on the rush grind. Anyway, I played The Last of Us back in 2013, but never finished it. But then, back in like October when it went free on PS4, I played it and finished it. And oh my god, is it a good game! But I think you've heard enough about the uh, about the crazy kids. I have not seen the Sonic the Hedgehog movie yet. I was planning on seeing it with friends, but then Corona happened, so, you know, maybe it's a sign that, you know, it's better I don't see it. You know, I heard it wasn't, like, inherently bad, but it's just the, another cheesy kids movie. And also he flosses in it. <laughs> Do it like a 1v1. I wish you could like challenge other people. What happened to Club Wars? Wasn't that like a rumor or was that just um something cancelled? I don't know, but like I wish we were able to challenge other clubs in like maybe a 4v4 race or something like that. That'd be pretty nice. Oh, there's a Gerardo in this race. Asphalt has been over for like two years now. I haven't taken that game seriously since I reclaimed my Desir world record. That was the last time I really put effort into that game. Yeah. My, my t-shirt is uh, classic Sonic, so... You know. The old, the good old days. The actual good games. Yeah, that's so weird seeing the Gallardo. It's such a rare car. Same thing with the Taken.
live stream the last of us too. There's a lot on my agenda that I have to do at some point. I'm way behind on what I want to do with this channel. I haven't played a casual game in forever. The Last of Us 2. That comes out next week though, I think, so I am excited about that. I tried to avoid every piece of information about that game because I know there was the leak that happened kind of recently. And it got delayed like twice. But it's finally gonna come back, but you know. I think I'll buy it on launch. Viper ACR is so easy to use. Why don't I wear my own merch? I don't know. I have two t-shirts still from my own. But um, they kind of shrunk on me. Or they just feel different. I don't know. But I like this t-shirt. It's comfortable and I just got it. It's like brand new. It's nice. Least favorite Spider-Man film, um, Amazing Spider-Man 2, the the one with Andrew Garfield, the second one though. The first one I thought was alright actually, but the second one, no. And if you've seen it, you know what I mean, but I did not like that one. Also, Spider-Man 3, also not very good, but it has Tobey Maguire, so. But I thought... The one with Andrew Garfield was worse. Oh, I'm amazed I didn't get my barrel stopped by that. Alright, so we gotta catch up to this H2. The second one is so good. Yeah, you like this? It's uh, Sonic the Hedgehog. I don't know if you could fully see it. I gotta stand up again to see the full design. Bro, look at that. That's pretty nice. I like it. Anyway, oh my god, I feel like we're progressing so slowly to get to gold. Let's use the Rizvani. Tom Holland or Tommy McGuire? I think Tom Holland's doing a good job, but Tommy McGuire is more iconic. I like Tommy McGuire better. But that's because I grew up with his movies. With those movies. I think the Tom Holland ones are pretty good. the ACR.
How about the scream at the um You know what I'm talking about, but like that iconic screen in Spider-Man 2. How did I make that mistake and still hold the lead? first movie is also pretty fun. Just those are two fun movies, the first two movies. I thought Into the Spider-Verse was a fantastic movie, honestly. The, uh, the animated one from a couple years ago, that was really good. I think a lot of people really liked that one too, so. I don't even know what car I clicked on. I gotta pay attention to driving. I did click on the ACR, so those who wanted it, here you go. You know why everyone uses the ACR? Everyone has it, and it's so easy to drive. I guarantee if everyone had the Huracan, they would drive it all the time, because it's one of the best cars ever in this game to drive. That's the reason everyone spams Corvette. If I had one more lap, I think I could have caught the NSX. And look at that gold pack, you get a BMW blueprint. Just what I wanted. Alright, um, let's go with the NSX. I'll say go when we play the Terzo. That should be actually coming up soon. So that was only a 47 minute wait time. Hey there, Logan Paul. How about I don't watch YouTube drama like that? Didn't Jake Paul just recently get arrested for leaving a mall in Arizona or something like that? Like, his gang robbed a P.F. Chang's or something like that. Yeah, the faster cars are definitely more exciting to drive. I'm gonna check on my Terzo, see how we're doing on that. It's ready. Okay, Afiq, you ready? I'm gonna say Terzo ready up. I won't start yet, but... Yeah, Ter Terzo MP is dead. It's, it's basically 1v1 season. 
it's amazing because there's like 600 people ahead of me. Brenton in P4. We're only at 1200. Yeah, YouTube drama is boring these days, though. Alright, so thank you there. Get ready, because we are going to get started on this. Dude, I don't follow either of those guys. You're gonna race. Alright, if you let me know when you're ready, so I can just give you my ratings. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I don't know how far the delay is on my stream, but I'm waiting for it. You feel like movies are getting bad. I feel like, um, I don't know. That seems to be the thing with everything. I do agree that these days movies are just kind of forgettable cash cows, reboots, remakes. Alright, we're ready? Let's go racing. Let's go. Boom. Boom. I mean, it's probably not going to be hard. I'm probably going to get a 1v1 with the Feek now that I just... Um... Sold the... <laughs> sold my soul to this. Which phone you should get? Um, get whatever you want because Asphalt 9 shouldn't run your life. Get the PC version if you want to actually get good performance. I didn't even get a feek. I got two guys who I don't even recognize. So the next Grand Prix is going to be the SC18. I guarantee it. Oh, and apparently it was loaded with pros, the, the lobby I missed out on. Is it because I'm in the other league and not in silver? See, progression's so slow in this season, and you only get three feels. This guy is a better Terzo than me. Oh my god, big lag. But no contact, so I don't have to worry about uh, getting around them. I just have to outdrive them. I didn't see how much uh, better his car was than mine. We still only go up 12 though. So he had a 39. Both of those were 4 stars I'm pretty sure. So... Yeah, I think I'm... Yeah, I'm one rating away from getting into Rookie, so I don't even know if I'll match with you guys in this one. But anyway, we're gonna do another one. Yeah, let's go. I think you guys are done with your race. Let's go. I just need to get one rating so I get in the right league. And Brenton was in P4 too, so... Yeah. I don't know what you guys have on your uh, Terza, what upgrades you got. Least favorite crash game. I mean, I haven't played every single one of them. Oh god, Nasser. Is that a fake? I'm not sure. I don't think so. But, um, of the ones I've played... I don't know if you want to count the GBA, um, minigame one. The Crash Spyro, um, crossover. 
it's just a mini game fest. Um, I loved it as a kid, but nowadays it's like, oh, this game is garbage. And then, um, I did re um, sell Wrath of Cortex to GameStop because I couldn't beat it. Looking back, I hate myself for doing that. Definitely faster than me, but this car is faster. But I gotta outdrive him. I can't drive defensively though. All right, at least we're in another league, so we can match maybe with uh, everyone else. Alright, last race. The progression is so slow. I hate this. This season sucks. Alright. You guys ready again? A <laughs> fake game crashed. Oof. It's a go season. Yeah. A fake's ready, so. Let's go. Terrell, Nasser, same guys before. And these guys all have cars that are better than mine. Oof. When I type go, it's in real time though. Is because of leagues they actually restrict it because I'm in um, sober or the equivalent of it. I'm gonna take the weird route, which is weird because that's the normal route. And I'm, I can't speak. I just spin so I had that weird uh, moment. Another P2 behind Terrell. We progress like nothing. This season is trash. I'm not saying this because I'm losing races, but there's like no matchmaking at all. So progression is like a slug. Unless you purposely boost it. So yeah, MP just does not work. How much fuel we got? Three? We can do another run with a chance scenario. Let's do that. See if I can improve. There's no slipstream out in this season though. I like slipstream. Because you do have to drive defensively. You have to change your driving style which is kind of nice. Yeah, Ghost Season is just glorified TLEs.
There we go. Land it. There we go. Maybe it wasn't as fast, but we definitely got better on this section. No. Let's risk it. Ooh. It's cancelled, so I couldn't hold Shockwave for that long, but we got a 135.9. Much better. Much better. Top 27. Not bad. Not bad. Not great, but definitely better than the first parts of the stream. But still not a 134. I had to play it uh, weirdly there, for sure. So, like, probably three more wins in MP, and then I can get into Gold League, so we can do a little bit of that. And then I figure out how to stall for more time. You can use, like, every card I've had, so, so. Let's go back to the, uh, vents here. There's my water. I was looking for it. Sun Racers 2 is J50. That's oddly specific. Francis is here. Welcome. Sensitivity is uh, 45. Grand Prix is probably going to be next Friday, I guess. I'm not 100% sure, but I think so because, um, you know, you got to start up the SC18 at some point. So I imagine next weekend is probably when they're going to release the Grand Prix. And then after that is probably when a new update's going to come. in Japan, yeah, Suzuka's not coming back this year. Neither is uh, Singapore and um, one more. I can't remember. Baku, I think it was? Maybe? I don't remember. I think it was Baku that was the last one. It was Singapore, Japan, and I think uh, Baku were the three races that can't return in 2020. I just want to get racing again. We're like three weeks away from an F1 race. Yeah, Master would be pretty good to grind right now. Just something for single player. Let's burn up our Venser, because why not?
boring racing. We miss Asphalt 7, yeah, we keep talking about the past games. I was playing some more Asphalt 2 on my DS just because why not? And, um, I don't know. Even that has a lot of, like, kind of boring elements. Out of fuel, yeah, that seems to be a common theme. Out of fuel. I only got 10 ratings in that race. See, so, yeah, I don't know. There's some things about, um, this game where it's just like, why just keep playing? Like, what's the point? But. We're still here. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. Whatever that quote is. Oh, finally, a full, full lobby. Let's see if I could pin my uh, phone charger. Like, clip it up before the race starts. Still good? Still good? Still good. What card do I want most in S Fault 9? Um Right now? F1 card would be pretty nice. Ferrari F1. Uh, Mazda 787B. My dream car, Ferrari 355, Berlinetta. You know, we need a 458. Ferrari 458 uh, is kind of forgotten these days, even though it's one of my all time favorite Ferraris. Mercy Alago definitely is missing from this game. We need one. my worst nightmare. Um, dying alone. <laughs> Oof. First dude you race is a fee, yikes. Also, we're finally in Gold League. About time. I was getting really bored with those races. So now we're in Corvette City, so... Let's see what... Blue flag, blue flag, blue flag. I mean, for 12, Justin just put in some good cars for us. Like the 9FF, definitely. Let's see, what can we drive? Let's drive the DBS. What will be the next update? Uh, I can't tell you, but... We'll see. Hopefully they don't um, keep this thing up with the season pass. I'm really not liking it. And then if I can get some Shear on Epic import parts somewhere, that'd be nice. But, yeah. I think the only thing we know is the McLaren F1 LM. I wonder how that will be released. In what capacity. Like, Grand Prix? It's a key, but... Are we 100% sure it's Grand Prix? Or is it something else that needs a key? I don't know. Anyway, here comes the Corvettes and the Huracans to shoot off into the distance. And remember, we do have contact enabled, so... Just gotta be aware of our surroundings. I just don't want to use the same thing over and over. I'm gonna beat all these touch drive boys with a DBS. The forgotten Aston. For sure. It's funny how I'm keeping up with all these people with like a three star DBS. Yes. Let's keep going. Come on. Connection. Oh god, that snapped a lot more than I was expecting. I don't even know where these people are because their connections are everywhere.
Oh, I was gonna say, come on, that Corvette's holding me back, but then I knocked him down. So, I got rid of one of the Corvette knobs, as you guys call him. DB11 next. Hi. Marcel Lago. I remember in Need for Speed Hyper Pursuit 2, they called it the Mercy Lago. Kanye West calls it the Mercy Lago. So I'm calling it the Mercy Lago. I used to call the Gallardo the Gallardo for like 17 years of my life. And then I finally switched to the right pronunciation. Alright, DB11, let's go. Touch drive, oh my god. No way I could win with a touch drive DB11. I guess the touch drive Corvette. And look at that pro, lucky, Max Turrican. I have no chance in this race. And we're starting in pole position, great. What's my camera view? Uh, close. Always close. Yeah, Mercy Lag is uh, contaminated. Yep, pole position against everything. The fight for your ACR is even uh Did I cause someone to crash right there? I need that hurricane to crash. But he's uh he's in pro, so I don't think he will. It's more likely I will crash actually. I think a Corvette's behind me. Graphics are not loading on me again. Oh my god. Oh, I tried to squeeze him and he spun. Oh my god. I wish I should have tried harder to kill him. Corvette. Come on. Use the uh, 911 GT1. Let's try the SAG. I should have taken down that Corvette. Let's do Apollos on Caribbean. So I have the advantage, except there's a Corvette right there, so I didn't even notice that. I personally like close camera. I used action back in Asphalt 8, but I think close is better in Asphalt 9, and I'm used to it, and I've been playing it for almost two years, so let's go. 911 GT3 RS. Yeah, they did that for the Career GT though, so like we had our shot, but I don't know what they're gonna do. We need the Gensi back, the Vija. Tech rules. I'm dying for the Tech rules to come back. Because that first Grand Prix was awful.
easy money. See, SCG is too easy. Let's try to win in the DB11 again. And I'm going to spin any Corvette that tries to pass me. Oh boy. So there's one Corvette. And we're on Osaka. And we're starting in the back. Or midfield. Oh no, never mind. We're starting in pole. Or front row. There's a Corvette in front. I got spiked by that traffic car. I knocked down the uh, Apollo there. Get out of my way. Where's my perfect run? There it is. Oh no. Ah. Oh. Thanks for subbing, guys. Ah, oh, that Apollo ruined my race. Traffic. My controller, it is the Xbox One S controller. The F12 is worth handling. Why you bully Corvette? Because all you do is just go on touch drive, hold down the down arrow key, hold down the drift button. And just automatically win, and then when anything gets in their way, they just double tap that brake. They only use the Corvette. Only use it. And I love driving that car, but in multiplayer, it is toxic. Favorite SpongeBob episode? I would say I'm Band Geeks. I would say Band Geeks because that's everyone's favorite episode. Um, pizza delivery also comes to mind. Um, Oh, there's so many good ones. Ripped Pants, like one of the best acoustic guitar songs in existence. Um, like every episode from the first three seasons were so good. And even some season four episodes were pretty awesome. Oh boy, same track. I don't know who's behind me. Oh, there's a Corvette, so... Already on that front. H2, I'll let you go. Ooh, some drama. No, you knocked me off. Oh, thank you, Corvette. Thank you so much. <laughs> that was so funny. Corvette helping me? It's like, uh... That's so weird. Alternate reality, guys. It's like where the bad guys help the good guy. I was trying to find one superhero movie where that happens, but I can't remember. Oh my god, spinning Apollo. Did the Corvette wreck? I think he did. I gotta pass the center one though. Somehow I gotta find a way around him. It's just faster. I'm still kind of keeping up with him. Here's my attack. Kamikaze! Aw, oh, it's a seat. Yeet! <laughs> Tried to get him. Almost. You're so close. Awaken on my sock. Is that a song? I'm scared of that. I don't know. Let's keep going. Watch your Jessica run the Osaka one. Oop. Rip. Yeah, guys, uh, Corvette's just solved, uh, 
every problem in the game. Clip that. They are they are good. They're good Corvettes. He didn't deserve to crash. I was going to avenge him. Only one Corvette, two Corvettes around Rome this time. Still starting towards the front. Sometimes you just gotta lick the stamp and send it. Thanks for seven guys. Hopefully we can get to 50k. We've been growing some subs recently at a slow but noticeable rate. We're at 42,554 as of my app. And yeah. I still have to decide what my all-time favorite Spongebob is, I'm not sure. <sighs> Which way are you gonna go, Corvette? Hey. Hey. I'm going this way. Boom. Oh! No spin needed. Thanks for subbing whoever that was. Trolling Corvettes Part 2. I just wanted to win the DB11 against the Corvette. And we did. No spin needed. Look at that. Nobody on my mini map. Easy. Easy peasy. Atlantis Square Pantis. No, I can't think of a definitive one that is my favorite because all of them are really good in the first three seasons. All of them. Hmm. I, I keep like going to pizza delivery. That's such a classic. So two. Here, let's do something. Let's do a club race with the Jesco. And we're gonna go on uh, Himalayas. Hmm. Frozen route to his Grand Prix PTSD, and we'll do three laps just so that we can uh, have a lengthy race. So. Yeah, Doodle Bob is pretty good. I'm gonna look up the episode list and see uh, if there's ones I explicitly remember. The one with the, the sea bear was so good. So while I'm waiting for a point, here's uh, the episodes. Yeah, there's pizza delivery. Home sweet pineapple was awesome. Pickles. Pickles was awesome. Jellyfish jam. Opposite day. Culture shock. SB129, that was one of my favorites. Hooky.
We're just waiting for one opponent so we could, uh... I just need one opponent. One opponent. Hmm. Dying for pie. Patty hype was so good. Squidville. The Christmas one. The smoking peanut. Secret box. Sailor mouth. Nasty Patty. Idiot Box. That was also really good. <laughs> Sailor Mouse so far is my favorite one. As seen on TV. Crab Borg. Wet Painters. The training video. I just used uh, the clip from the training video. <laughs> Last week for my Jesco edit. The Great Snail Race. <laughs> the camping episode. I gotta say Sailor Mouth is my favorite one. Van Geeks, I'd say, is like a close second. Pizza Delivery third, but I loved Sailor Mouth. That was one of my favorites. There are 17 or 13 bad words. I can't remember how many bad words there were. But that was really funny. Imagination. That's Idiot Box. Idiot Box is really good. Come on. Please, someone join. There, that's so sad. There is zero online. I don't know if that's a bug, but... I want to drive this. I'm going to send a message in our Discord. The Ben and Stimpy, really? I thought that was a good one. I wish we could watch Spongebob here, but that's obviously copyright infringement. Yeah, we're on, uh, the other, the third legions. for one person I have we have some open spots leave your club and join ours just so you can race I created the thing should we just invite a fake to this club and then just kick him out as soon as we're done with the club race we have space Rock bottom was good. Branson, you can't hop in. Enjoy your new sub. Thank you. Come on, we're just waiting. Oh, I think someone's joining. Someone's joining. Marson. You want to claim Terra's Overpins first? That's okay, I think someone's joining. See, I don't know if I'd get in trouble. I am. I can invite people, like, but I don't know if like that's going to break something if I invite a Feek from ProTM into the main club.
<laughs> I'm waiting for someone to join. Marson, come come here. I know this is boring to watch this. Let's play some guitar while we're out waiting. Does that sound good? I'm in uh, the third LU club. Where's Marson at? Come on, Marson. You're back, you're watching- 113 people are watching this blank screen. I just want to drive to Jesco for a bit. Yeah. Victory Screech! Thanks for subbing. Who's getting the PS5? Um, I am planning on getting it because it's Grand Turismo 7. If it is a launch title, I'm going to buy one on launch. I, th I even still think I'll buy one, even if it gets delayed or something, but... Yeah. Right? We're waiting. I, I don't want to, like, stall. We might have to. Yeah, Marson tro trolling me. Big time. It's just He's like, oh, I don't have the Jesco. It's like, can we just race, please? <laughs> You're 40k away from getting the Jesco blueprints. Like, that would take like three days in this club, but for you guys, it'd probably take like half an hour. The campfire song. I know how to play Ripped Pants. Oh, okay, there we go. Let's go. That took way too long to set up, but. Hey, Stalin, right? He doesn't even have the sheer run. Wow. Okay, that's fine. Jesco, 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 Jesco. Oh, could I have gotten that in the Grand Prix? This is like PTSD flashbacks, anyone? Oh, way too steep. Way too steep. Look at the speed on this thing. This is crazy, this car. They should just throw this for one esports race. Aw, oh, I got spiked. Hey, at least we're level. <laughs> you just shot off into the distance. Alright, let's see if we can pass him. Did 
can just spin him. Alright, I'm gonna try to KD him. I'll try to pass. Go, Jesco. <laughs> that was actually pretty good, even if I couldn't win that one. That was pretty fun. I liked that. Only a tenth of it in there. That was fun. Alright, thanks, Marston, for playing. Jesco's so fast, I just can't drive. But, look at this. Someone earlier was saying I was a slacker in rep. In, uh, rep. Come on. <laughs> slacker in rep, you say? I'm carrying right now. No. Because we played today on stream for two hours. Anyway, yeah. Pretty far behind in terms of club milestones, but it is what it is. How much fuel we got? Four? I think we can do a run with the Jesco again for s -Cus Elite. See if I can improve. See if we can do a little bit better. GG. Thanks, Marson, though. Nice race. You put up an awesome fight with that Fenner. Play guitar. We might still. I have improved a lot since I first played for you guys, like, two months ago. Marston, you're literally shaking. Yeah, that was really fun. Oh, no shockwave. Let's see if I can do that spin thing. Okay, that works. Aw, oh, I lost so much speed there. So much. Land it! Oh my god. I still have some speed. This is not going to be as good as the first run though. I don't have any of the speed. It's gonna be like a 103. It's a 103 too, so actually it's not that far behind, but not the best. Yeah. Just how fast you could catch up is just insane. Also, yeah, Marston, thanks for playing. Yeah, rip, right? We had a decent first part of the race, but then I just lost so much speed and then messed up the end. No shockwave or anything. Let's try with the sheer on just to see how we can do. So drift. The turn after the brochure, drift, shockwave, what drift again, kind of and then shockwave. The yeah, let's try with the sheer on. The route is similar, I remember. I think I was able to do a 101 once, but you need a great run. Aww. Jessica ruined it. Okay, gun's dead. Well, let's just continue, because why not? better than the Jesco what I did with it. The 
yeah, this is gonna be like a 104. <laughs> the Sharon feels so slow after driving the Jesco. Oh, it's a 1038. Yeah, perfect start, right? I look like a lonely nerd who hasn't gone outside in a while. Thanks. Let's reinforce that by driving the Corvette. Yeah, double 16 win. Alright, so here's my challenge for you. I'm not going to look. I'm just going to hold down um, the brake on touch drive and tell you how easy this is. Watch this. This is how we're going to end today. No looking. I'm just going to turn my head around and just show you how easy this is. Sometimes so, you just gotta lick the staff I gotta turn in the game audio, so I'm gonna switch it so that I can hear it. Sorry, you guys might not be able to. Maybe I'll turn it up so that you guys can hear it through the mic. Let's see, though. Let's see. But without looking, I need to know what track it is, but without looking and on touch drive, holding the brakes, I'm just going to hold the brakes, and I guarantee you I won't finish last. Watch this. If I hear I'm in midair, I'm going to uh, nitro, but watch this. No looking. No looking. No looking, guys. It's this easy. I just hit shot it because I heard I was in the air, but look at that. I got fourth. 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 Fourth doing that. It's that easy. Hit the boost. Some next gen stuff there. It's that easy though. But that's why the Corvette is so toxic in this game. Let's see if I can get on the podium. Well, let's do that one more time. I, I want to see if we get on the podium doing that. Same thing. Same deal. Let's see if I can get on the podium. Oh, we're on Rome too. Maxed Apollo N in this race. For driving right here. Oh god, this race might be a bit harder to win, but let's see. Let's try this. No looking. You guys know it. I'm gonna keep the mic with... Or actually, we'll keep it this way. It might be hard to hear me from back here when I'm talking in the opposite direction. But, let's see. Just like that. Now this whole perfect extra for a little bit just approves it. I don't even have to pay attention and I can win this race. 
I don't even know where I am on the track. It just works. It just works. I'm your car. I don't even know where I am. I don't even know where I am. I was just shocked, wait. I won that. I got someone with knockdown? Are you kidding me? <laughs> How far did I win by? I won by two and a half seconds. Seconds! This is why people hate the grand sport. I don't even have to look winning the race. I don't have to look driving this car at all. Blind. Blind. And I knocked someone down. I gotta check that out. Because <laughs> what happened there? I heard I was near a car. I was using the game audio to help me on where I was in the track, but let's see. I was totally blind there. I was just using audio. Let's see, where did I kill somebody? So I dropped down. Oh, I got to knock down the Apollo from behind. That's funny. And I even drifted at the right spots. That is so funny. Post it after the stream is over. We will do that. I'm going to clip that. Because that is... That is king. Create highlight. Come on. Why can't I select where? Um, what? Did I just lose the stream? Hello? Where'd my stream go? I'm refreshing. Yeah. So I just created that highlight. I'm going to edit it a little bit and upload it later today. <laughs> but yes, blind touch drive. Hopefully you guys leave a like if you enjoyed that. Blind Corvette touch drive. How about every week, every week, when we run out of content like this, we'll do a blindfolded race with a different car. Like next week we should try it with the Huracan, and then the next week we should try it with the Viper ACR. We should just try it with all- we should just like do a big expose on all the cars that are just so easy to drive, you can do it blindfolded. I'll get a physical blindfold and we'll do it just with audio. Completely blind, yes. But how about that? Every week at the end of our streams we'll do a blindfolded race. Does that sound good? I think it does. Anyway, with that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Like I said, leave a like if you enjoyed. 
But yeah. <laughs> That's why people don't like the Corvette. Enjoy my Sonic the Hedgehog t-shirt. Gotta go fast. And yeah, I will talk to you guys next week. Bye-bye. Oh wait, one more donation. With the shawl scream. A dollar for your efforts or lack of. Well done. <laughs> Thank you so much, Brenton, for that. Yeah, lack of effort. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next week. Bye-bye.